Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when you are unable to install this update that is KB5062552 on your Windows 11 computer. Now the first step is to pause and restart the update. So go to Windows update. Over here you can see pause option. So hit pause. This process may take some time and once paused now you can click on resume updates. So just pause and resume the updates and then check. Still not working. The next step is to start app readiness service. Now for this type in services in Windows search box and then click on services. Now find app readiness. Make a double click on app readiness. Set this to automatic. Click on apply. Click on start if highlighted and then click on OK and then check. Still not working. The next step is to run update troubleshooter for this open windows settings. Go to system. Go to troubleshoot option. Click on other troubleshooters. Now over here you can see windows update. Click on run. Now on this screen here you can see run the windows update troubleshooter and here you have to select the option which says I can't download install or uninstall an update click on it and over here you can see the prompt which says can can we run the windows update automated diagnostic click on yes and just follow the on screen instruction to troubleshoot and then check. If you face any problem over here, in that case, the next step is to restart Windows Update or Background Intelligent Transfer Service. Now for this type in Services in Windows Search Box, click on Services. Find Windows Update in the list. Make a double click on Windows Update. Set this to Automatic. Click on Apply. Click on Start if highlighted and then click on OK. With this selected, make a right click, click on Restart. Now find Background Intelligent Transfer Service. Make a double click, set this to automatic. Click on apply, click on start if highlighted. Now with this selected, make a right click, then click on restart. And then you can check. Still not working. In that case, the next step is to use Windows 11 installation assistant. Now for this, copy this link. The link is provided in the video description. Open this link in a browser. It will take you to Microsoft website. On this website, here you can see Windows 11 installation assistant. Click on download now. And then run this exe file. Click on yes to allow. Now if you see install option or update option, you can install the update from here. Still not working. The next step is to use Microsoft update catalog. Now for this, copy this link. The link is provided in the Video description, open this link in a browser. It will take you to Microsoft website. Over here, write down the name of the update that is KV5062552 over here. Click on search. And over here, you have to select the right version. Now, you have to check the version. So, so type in WINVER -E Winver in Windows search box. Click on Winver over here. And you will see a version over here. So in my case, it's version 24H2. So in your case, it will be 22H2 or 23H2. So, and we have to, you have to check which, what kind of system you have. So you can go to systems, uh, go to si settings system and then go to about option. Over here, you can see 64 bit operating system. So if you have Windows 11 version 23 H2 X64 based system, then this is the right update for you. If you have Windows 11 version 22 H2 X64 based system, then this is the right update for you. So click on download and then you can install this update manually. So click on this link and once the download is complete, you can click on this file and you can install this update manually and then restart your computer. Still not working. The next step is to reset Windows update components. Now for this, copy all these commands. These commands are provided in the video description. So copy till here. Now open notepad. So type in notepad in Windows search box and then click on notepad. Paste all the command over here. Go to file, click on save as. You can set the location as desktop and then name this file as wufix.bat. And then for save as type, select all files over here. Go 
click on save now go to desktop here you can see wu fix file make a right click on wu fix file and make sure that you run wu fix bat file as an administrator so click on run as administrator click on yes to allow and let the process complete this process will take some time so first of all it will stop all the windows update services if you see this prompt for yes or no type in y hit the enter key and let the process complete so first of all it will stop all the windows update services and then it will run some scans so there are a couple of scans so the scan will take some time and once all the scans are complete it will restart all the windows update services and then once the whole process is complete then restart your computer and after the system restart you can check still not working the next step is to use option which that is fix problems using windows update now for this you can open windows settings go to windows update and then go to advanced option scroll down go to recovery option over here you can see the option which says fix problems using windows update this will reinstall your current wizard current version of windows your apps files and settings will be preserved so click on reinstall now this process will take some time and once this is complete you can check still not working the last step is to use media creation tool to use media creation tool uh, copy this link the link is provided in the video description open this link in a So one of the steps shown in this video should help you to install this update successfully on your Windows 11 computer. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.